coming up on today's episode of Airborne Unlimited. Embraer to debut Phenom 100EX at NBAA base. Airbus Flight Test New Electric Flight Control System. Palata significantly improves its PT-24 light biz jet. Welcome to Airborne Unlimited. I'm your host, Holland Lee. Let's get into today's stories. Embraer to debut Phenom 100 EX at NBAA Base 2023. Embraer has unveiled the Phenom 100 EX. The approximately $5 million Phenom 100 EX is powered by a pair of 1,730 pounds force thrust Pratt & Whitney twin spool, reverse flow combustor, dual channel FADEC controlled PW617F1E engines, which motivate the little jet to a VNE of Mach 0.7, a high speed cruise of 406 knots, and a service ceiling of flight level 410. Certified for single pilot operation, the Phenom 100 EX's cabin can be configured to seat as many as seven passengers. The machine's standard cabin configuration, however, accommodates five. The Phenom 100 EX has a four occupant range of 1,178 nautical miles with NBAA IFR reserves. Phenom 100 EX pilots will enjoy the jet's open concept cockpit and superior legroom. Pilots are to be aided in their work by Embraer's G3000-based Prodigy Touch avionics suite, featuring a runway overrun awareness and alerting system by which aviators are afforded comprehensive understanding of anticipated landing conditions. Additional technologies innate to Embraer's Phenom 100EX include Flightstream 510 connectivity solution, 3D volumetric scanning with lightning and hail prediction, predictive wind shear, stabilized approach, and turbulence detection. Embraer's engineers managed to shave 190 pounds of weight from the Phenom 100 EX's interior compared to the model's legacy Phenom 100 stablemates, while increasing cabin space to class-leading height and width dimensions. Passenger comfort is further enhanced by widened seats and abundant natural light. Coming up after the break, Cessna delivers 100th Citation Longitude. Skyleader Aircraft offers a lineup of the most powerful, durable, and efficient light sport aircraft in the industry. From trainers to roomy cockpits for long hauls, Skyleader has an aircraft for you. And the best part? They're in your budget. Skyleader's base prices are set low to give you room to customize your aircraft to your needs, desires, and wallet, allowing you to put your money where it matters to you most. Visit FlySkyleader.com today to learn about our aircraft, customization options, and chat with the team. Throughout the globe, Piper Aircraft has hand-selected the very best in company representation, service, and support. From first inquiry to acquisition to product support, Piper Aircraft ownership is seamless and worry-free. Piper Aircraft authorized dealers, factory trained, factory connected. Welcome back. Now let's take a trip around the patch for some shorter stories. Cessna delivers 100th Citation Longitude. Cessna has delivered the 100th Citation Longitude business jet to an undisclosed but reportedly longtime Citation customer. Announced at 2012's eBase convention and FAA type certified in 2019, Cessna Citation Longitude is a super mid-size business aircraft comprising design cues from numerous and proven Textron aircraft models. The Longitude sports new 28-degree swept wings incorporating moderate winglets, a T-tail empennage, and area rule fuselage contouring. All told, the Longitude's aluminum fuselage and wing are similar to those of the Hawker 4000, albeit longer and of greater span, respectively. Dassault to debut Falconway's Route Optimization app Dassault Aviation has developed a new flight planning tool by which Falcon pilots may reduce instances of fuel tankering by selecting the most fuel-efficient routes. 
Dubbed Falcon Ways, the solution comprises in part updated global wind data optimization and model-specific performance algorithms. Falcon Ways will be offered as a flight app on Dassault's Falcon Sphere iPad electronic flight bag and is compatible with Jepson and Universal flight planning tools. Falcon Ways, during actual flight operations, facilitated reductions in fuel consumption as much as 7%. Virgin Galactic completes fifth successful manned spaceflight. Virgin Galactic, the California-based spaceflight subsidiary of Sir Richard Branson's Virgin Group, announced on October 6, 2023 that its Galactic 4 mission, the company's fifth manned spaceflight in five months, has been successfully completed and the three private astronauts born spaceward aboard such had returned safely to Earth. Virgin Galactic asserts its unbroken string of successful space flights evinces the company's ability to deliver safe, repeatable space travel and a transformative customer experience. Sporties debuts 2023 Crystal Christmas Ornament Sporties has released the 39th in its series of Crystal Christmas Ornaments, thereby keeping alive an annual tradition enjoyed by pilots, FBOs, flight schools and aviation enthusiasts alike. 2023's ornament features the classic Aeronca Champ, known affectionately by its admirers as the Air Knocker. Produced in large volumes in the late 1940s, the single-engine machine featured a high fabric-covered wing and a conventional tail-dragger undercarriage. The aircraft, which competed directly with Piper's mythical J-3 Cub, was plied primarily to flight instruction and recreational flying. Well, that's it for today's trip around the patch. Let's get back to the rest of the news. Airbus Flight Test New Electric Flight Control System Airbus Helicopters Demonstrator Flight Lab has successfully tested an electric flight control system salient to a new human-machine interface destined for installation on the company's City Airbus NextGen eVTOL prototype. The milestone test occasioned an important step toward the advent of electric-powered UAM aircraft. The flight controls as tested have been simplified considerably by dint of the enhanced piloting assistance provided by the electric flight control system. The technology is unique in the helicopter industry insofar as one single stick replaces the three pilot controls, cyclic, collective, and anti-torque pedals characteristic of conventional helicopters. Using the single stick, the pilot is able to perform all flight maneuvers, including takeoff, climb, accelerate, decelerate, turn, hover, pivot, descent, approach, and land. The single stick takes up less space, facilitates improved pilot visibility, and integrates with a revised HMI which uses simple displays providing a selection of information specifically tailored to eVTOL operations. In the wake of the successful flight test campaign, Airbus Helicopters is finalizing the newly vetted flight control system in advance of a secondary series of tests to be conducted within the context of Vertex, a project undertaken in partnership with Airbus Up Next, a consortium initiative that seeks to identify, evaluate, mature, and validate new products and services. Coming up after these messages, Pilatus significantly improves its PC-24 light biz jet. Well, hello, fellow pilot. I'm John King. And I'm Martha King. You know, we've all had our flying lives disrupted lately. Well, King Schools is here to help you stay up to date with courses that you can access on your desktop, iPad, or iPhone. If you'd like a refresher or just want to expand your aviation horizons, we have a course for you. So head over to kingschools.com slant rusty today for details. Flying is my entire life. It's all that I've ever known. I've relied on Hartzell propellers since about 1995. Hartzell means much more than a propeller. It's a relationship. When you hear the phrase, built on honor, they care about us as pilots, they care about our community, and they care about the product they build. It's such a proud honor to fly behind that propeller. Welcome back. Pilatus significantly improves its PC-24 light business jet. Pilatus has upped the full fuel and maximum payloads of its proven and popular PC-24 light business jet by an impressive 600 pounds. The increase facilitates a 200 nautical mile increase to the aircraft's six-passenger range. Beginning with new aircraft delivered in 2024, the full fuel single pilot payload of Pilatus's PC-24 will be raised to 1,315 pounds. The aircraft's maximum payload capacity will be increased to 3,100 pounds. To define the PC-24's flight envelope at the higher design weights, 
Pilatus engineers undertook an extensive flight test campaign. At the aircraft's new maximum takeoff weight, balanced field length at sea level is 3,090 feet. Moreover, the PC-24 is capable of operating from unpaved runways. In addition to useful increases in the aircraft's payloads, Pilatus engineers endowed the latest iteration of the PC-24 with enhancements the likes of reduced cabin ambient sound levels, refined cabinetry and storage areas, and the optional inclusion of a large side-facing divan which can be converted into a bed. By dint of a partnership with Lufthansa Technik, Pilatus's PC-24 now sports a new integrated cabin management system featuring a 10-inch touchscreen controller with 3D moving map, four high-fidelity cabin speakers with a subwoofer option, mood lighting, USB ports, and a media storage server. Beginning with serial number 501, all factory new PC-24s will be equipped with a telemetry feature that enables predictive services. And that's our show for today. You can catch episodes of Airborne on YouTube, Roku, or Fire TV. Just search for Aero News or Airborne, and don't forget to follow us on social media. Thanks for watching.